been doing this uh, oh, seven times. Now we've fought floods in four years, and this is as much water as I've seen uh, all the way back to 93 uh, when we were flood fighting. How does it make you feel seeing what's coming south? You've still got a lot of Missouri to go through. Well, you know, the National Guard's a community-based organization. I mean, uh, all our soldiers come from the towns that are affected and the counties that are affected, and, uh, both Army Guard and Air Guard. So this is a hometown fight uh, for all of us that uh, live here, in, uh, well, wherever you are in Missouri. And, and whatever the Guard is doing, it's always a community effort. How does it make you feel to see those guys out there jumping in with the neighbors? Well, I'm really proud of them. I mean, all our soldiers uh, are uh, traditional, uh, what we call M-Day soldiers. They work full time uh, uh, at factories and businesses and so forth. And uh, they are literally the Minutemen of old where they drop their plowshares and uh, come running to the fight. And so uh, these soldiers have given their time and effort from their jobs uh, and their employers uh, to come and uh, uh, help protect good people from bad things. So it's a sacrifice uh, uh, on the employer's part, and we thank them for their support of our guardsmen. Uh, but uh, it's uh, a welcome relief for the communities that uh, can see these uh, soldiers and uh, airmen uh, working hard on their behalf.